Yo, welcome back to my channel. I am Air Max London, and today I'm bringing you another unboxing. So today I'm going to be unboxing a Jordan 1 High. It is none other than the OG High Core Purple, otherwise known as the Metallic Purple. Um, let's start with the box. It's white. It's lovely. It's got purple for the night. Everything's in purple other than the actual box. Uh, it's pretty much a standard box. This is a women's only release, so I was able to only get a UK 9.5, a US 12. That is the biggest size. Let's have a look. You'll notice when you open it, it comes with this Jumpman logo paper, which is quite nice. Don't know why they all don't have that. Okay. Core purple, metallic purple, Jordan 1 High. Originally released in 1985, um, probably shortly after the original colorway came out. It was part of a pack, it was a blue. Um, a red, an orange, etc. Received a retro in 2009. Uh, the shoe was a little bit different. Apparently, the leather was terrible. Had a jump man on the back, had a jump man on the tongue tab. Um, you know, a few other differences, probably. Fast forward to 2021, and we get not a full retro, not a full retro, but as close a retro as we are going to get. A few noticeable differences about this over the 85 pair would be the swoosh has been made a bit smaller as it's a woman's release. The collar is a bit deeper or higher, whatever you want to call it. Um, I imagine due to it being a woman's release. The tongue is lined with velvet on the inside. The sock liner is velvet on the inside. Um, I haven't seen an 85 metallic purple in hand. I'm not sure if it had that same white tongue. Um, but we've got purple sole. We've got white level all over with this metallic paint, paint and effect purple on the rear collar on the back cut out pieces here and on the swoosh. Um, surprisingly for someone that doesn't like white shoes, I really like this. It does come with purple laces for the swap. Um, I don't really see what else you could chop into it. Yeah, I'm not really sure what else you could go with. I'd probably keep it with the white. Another noticeable difference over the 85 pair would be the fact that the wings is smaller. Um, I mean, this is all due to it being a women's release. They've decided to, to tone down things a bit. I'm not too sure why you would do that, but um, I suppose that helps keep amazing value on any surviving metallic purple 85 pairs because it's, it's not just a straight retro. But yeah, I picked these up from SNS today. They released yesterday worldwide. There was toddlers and preschool sizing available. Um, SNS came through for me. Super unexpected. And I'm pretty happy with these. Um, I'm usually a UK 10, so I'm just gonna slide one on and see how it feels. Sometimes they can come up a bit tight for me. actually feels a lot better than I thought. Um, it's a tad tight, which is obviously to be expected as I'm half a size down. Um, but it's not as tight as say my satin Jordan ones or, or 
my, my other women's children mods. I can't remember, I'm having a mind freeze here. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this cool purple OG high or metallic purple as people seem to call it. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. That was another unboxing. I'm out. See you soon.